What's good, YouTube? It's the all knowing, all loving, all feeling, all seeing, all powerful. Just damn all everything. Sex is hell. Host of the Life Games channel, Lamont Tyson. Bring you guys streaming media Monday through Thursday. Friday, I attempt to fire, stick, and chill. We're starting a new episode called Stream It, a movie theater, Beam It. So I can help save you guys time, effort, and money when you make the decision to sit down and watch something entertaining. Should you stream it at home? Should you go to the movie theater? I'm going to help you make them games as well. And I'm going to try to do this show in four minutes so that you can make that informed decision. If you enjoy the content on my channel and want to always get an alarm whenever I drop a new video, then take your little cursor and click on this little bell. And anytime I drop a new video, You'll get it first. I got three movie selections for you guys this weekend. And the first one is definitely one you should go theater beam. You want to see this one in the movie theater. And I'm talking about Logan. Yes, ladies and gentlemen, that movie is definitely worth you going to the theater. It is an excellent movie. One of the best movies that has come out this year. General synopsis. Don't go to the theater thinking it's going to be like the old X-Men movies where you're going to have X-Men versus X-Men. It's not of that nature. If you are a fan of the Transporter, think of it like that, where Wolverine slash Logan is the ultimate Transporter bodyguard. And the story has him and two other mutants as the last three mutants alive to their knowledge. What happens from that story, ladies and gentlemen? A group of individuals have stolen some of his DNA and have kind of started the Weapon X program and come to find out they have cloned some little mutants and one of them winds up being his seed and he has to protect that young lady. And when I tell you this young lady is a bad mofo, this chick is a bad mofo. Outstanding young actress. She did a hell of a job in this movie, ladies and gentlemen. So if you want to spend your money on something worth going to the theater, Logan is definitely it. Wolverine is old as hell. It's a great story. And the way they finish the story, ladies and gentlemen, it is something that they can build a new series on for the X-Men Wolverine series with a new character. Because this was my main man's last run at Wolverine. So go enjoy this one at the theater. Moving right along. Number two, ladies and gentlemen, is Kong Scroll Island. It's America's favorite ape, ladies and gentlemen. Back for a new rendition. And this movie, I can kind of shoulder lean toward you just beaming it at home. It's okay if you go to the theater, but more so you might want to wait so you can stream it at home when there's a good quality. It has the movie that starts out with the ape being the antagonist, as usual. Then he winds up having a huge adversary, these big ugly wormy things that come out of the earth. They become the antagonist. But throughout the end of the movie, ladies and gentlemen, the ultimate antagonist winds up being the cuss master himself, Samuel L. Dam Jackson. He winds up being the ultimate antagonist close to the end of the movie. And that's where this shit got real sketchy, ladies and gentlemen. That's when it just kind of went to hell in a handbasket. That's why I say you might as well wait for that one to be in high quality on whatever your favorite stream is. Wait for this one, watch it at home. Okay movie, but it's not theater worth your money, all right? Last, but definitely not least. For those of you that are new to my channel, when I'm getting ready to get X-rated or start using bad words, I call it, I'm turning into the rated R YouTube superstar. And ladies and gentlemen, this movie I'm about to discuss now turns me in to that individual. So if you don't like, explicit cussing skip to the move skip to the end of this video but please like it before you do because i'm about to be hot so let's get into it power rangers ladies and gentlemen <laughs> god what a fucking disaster i mean this movie is hot garbage ladies and gentlemen hot garbage i went to the theater to see this and i left out with the worst faces in the world my wife always teases me when I go to any movie that has something to do with my childhood that they have remade and it's, it's, they destroy it, she always says I give these crazy faces.
Disregard that last picture, ladies and gentlemen. I want that sad, but damn it, I was sad. How the hell this movie make it to the theater? This shit shouldn't even have been on cable TV. This should have been straight to CBS after school special because this movie is horrible, ladies and gentlemen. The whole entire time you're circling these young high school kids and what they're going through in high school and they eventually transform into Power Rangers in the last act of the whole movie. The shit is horrible. I don't understand how it made it. Do not, and I repeat, do not spend your hard-earned money going to see this in theater. Hell, don't even stream it. Wait for this shit to drop on cable. This is the worst fucking movie in 10 years. 10 years, ladies and gentlemen. This shit is horrible. Don't see it. If you just want to send the wife and kids out so that you can have man time or something like that, fellas, don't even do that. Don't even send them to see it. Don't waste your money. Worst movie I've seen in 10 years. It ain't even worth seeing. And I'm saving y'all from blowing $20 or whatever it costs you to go to the movie theaters nowadays. The best part of this movie was Rita Repulsa and her outfit and her saying she had all the sayings from the old Power Rangers. She was very evil. She was very conniving. She was even killing people in the movie, not the, the nice killer. I mean, she jumped on somebody and she ate the hell out of their ass. But that's it. That was it. All right, ladies and gentlemen, that is going to do it for the first episode of Stream It or Theater Beam It. Don't forget to like this video, ladies and gentlemen. Comment and subscribe. Go out there and get yourself a life game. Follow me so I can help you save money and let you know whether or not you should go to that movie theater or stay home and watch it at home. And all the selections I've given you, i recently seen them so that I can make sure I'm giving you guys the best, most accurate information because I want you to save that money. Check my video description box below my video. Do business with me. Do business with my affiliates. Till the next sexy as hell video, I'll see you.